With all the changes that are coming here in Lake Orion on the waterfront, I just wanted to make a quick video to document some of the before and after things. This location here is supposed to be one of the oldest or the oldest cottage on the lake, possibly. As we continue down past the little marina here, I can remember then this was a, a party convenience store. People could stop in here anytime and get snacks and beverages and stuff. They had a gas pump, I believe, had a little dock here we could pull up and get fuel, and a boat launch where you could pay a few dollars to launch a boat. And all this is going to be developed into the new condo housing project. Beautiful views of the lake from over here, though. It's quite a big piece of property here. It's not real deep, but it covers a long area. You know, I remember when Dr. Swoboda's doctor office used to be right here where this driveway is. How many of you remember that? And then Hadrill's Motel and several of these other old buildings are going to bite the dust. I think one or two of them are going to be preserved, which is a good thing. And then a little bit further up, we got this fairly new building here, which was never very well utilized, going to be gone, along with the Orion Cabins. And I lived in one of these for one summer when I was about six years old. I think me and my dad lived in cabin number three or four. Honestly, I can't remember which one it was. They're all pretty darn similar. But it was kind of fun living here for that summer. Yeah. Be here right on the lake and close to downtown. And I remember spending a lot of time fishing right up here at the little dock on the lake and just talking to the other people who were here and you know, having a good time here that one summer with my dad. And then you go down Heights Road and you know, all these houses along here, I believe, are scheduled to be demolished to make room for the condos. And right on around the corner, all the way over to the Snug Harbor Marina. Well, I used to go and get a lot of bait and fishing tackle back in the early 80s when I did a lot more fishing down in this area. Things change. Things develop. Not much you can do about it because no matter what happens, things are going to change. Sometimes for the better, sometimes just different. You know, it's just how it is. But I wanted to document how it looks right now so that we'll have a record of it. Thanks for watching and have a great day.